Hey guys, welcome back to the third and final part of Stockpot Refine. Um, a lot more has evaporated, it's left it a bit monkey on top. Um, it's been ridiculously hot. The minimum day temperature has been about 100, 105, 110. And uh, I'm over it. It's been probably two weeks since I did part two. And I just want to get this done. Even now it's hot, but I'll tough it out and do it. And how much gold is in here depends on how efficient I was when I first did it. I may have got it all back then, or, or maybe I missed something. I don't. I won't know until I get to the bottom. And the other, pe the other lot of uh, sediment that was in the other bucket, I have strained through a filter. So when I sort this one out, I'll also put this into a filter, and then I'll put both filters into a. Uh, It looks like there's a lot of sediment in there, but that could also be um, muck from the batches that I've done. There's a lot of stuff in there and it's not just precious metal, it's all gritty, it could be salts because of the evaporation, a lot of that could be salts. Uh, that's about as much as I want to tip out because I'm pretty sure I'm going to be sucking up precious metal now. So I'm going to put this into the stock pot too. This here I'm going to fill to the top of the water to, to dilute all that and it shouldn't be so dark and it should be a light green and I should be able to see what's in there. So I'll go and do that now. I'll just tip this into the stock pot one. I can sit down and drain for a bit. I'll go and pull this up. Hi. I'll drink off the uh, jug first. Wash this all off the side of the bucket. I'm going to fill this right up, but what I'm going to do now is leave it under here so it's not out in the heat. I might be able to process it a lot faster then. I'm doing it on jet so I'll wash all the sediment down there. So I'm just going to let that sit now, let all the sediment drop down and this here, the excess water that I've just put in there will go back into the stock pot too as well and I should be able to see the bottom stuff a lot clearer and then that'll all go through a filter. Okay, I should be able to scoop off the water, you can see it's a lighter green than what it was before. All the heavies have sunk to the bottom. I'm still being careful because I don't want to stir it up. When I get down to the, the heavies, I will wash it again. There's no point in having the no, it makes it hard on the purity and yeah, refining it and refining it when all you gotta do is keep it clean now, give it a good clean. 
get a lot of the stuff out so I just set up a whole pile. I don't know if you can see it all stirring up. So I'll let it rest now. Come back and do some more soon. This can go in my stock pot too. I'll be back soon. Now that it's settled, I'll be able to get some more. Um, no, I haven't got gloves on because I'm not going to be touching the acid. Doesn't take much to stir it up. I've got a feeling that silver that's going there because that kind of thing silver does. See how it's all stirring up there. I'm going to fill it up with some more water again. Yeah, see it all there stirring up. All right, I'm going to put some more water in and come back later. Well, I've removed most of the green liquid. There it is. There. This looks green a little bit, but it's clear. You can see the stuff in the bottom. Um, I've been rinsing it, and I've got to keep rinsing it just to try and get rid of this green. Uh, I'll need two hands, so I'll pour that into here and show you what I'm left with. All right, so I'm at the stage now where the sediment has all settled. I've been pouring the solution off into here, and now, that looks like a lot of solution, but it's not all, unfortunately, precious metal. Um, there's a lot of copper in there. There's actually quite a lot of copper in, in a finely divided state because, as I said before, when I processed the stock pot last time, the stock pot two, I put the copper back into stock pot one, and this is what hasn't dissolved. So, there's precious metals amongst that. Now, the way that I, there's two ways that I can separate the precious metal from the copper. One is to use nitric acid, which would make copper nitrate, and I have no use for copper nitrate, or use sulfuric acid and make copper sulfate. Now, copper sulfate I can use. I can use that to make copper as, which I can then use to drop gold. So, I'm going to make up, using this here, I'm going to dissolve it using sulfuric acid, make copper sulfate, and then I'll be left with the precious metals. I can filter the precious metals off, get my copper sulfate, and then make copper as down the track. So, I know you guys want to see the gold, and you will, be patient, but I'm going to end the video at this point, because I'm going to make a video about making copper sulfate. The reason why is if I do this now, and if someone out there was to do a search for copper sulfate, they're not going to see me doing this process. If I stop it and make a video called how to make copper sulfate, then I'll be able to help people who want to know how to do it. And if you tune in for the next video, then you will see the process and you will get to see the gold at the end of it, or whatever else is in there. So, you can see... What I've done to get to this point, and you know that the precious metals are there, and it's just as soon as I dissolve the copper, I'll have it. So at this point, I'll say I hope you enjoyed this uh, series. I don't like doing part uh, videos, but I've, I've had to with this one. Um, so please come back and watch as I make copper sulfate, get my precious metals, and we'll see what I've got. Uh, so until then, thanks for watching. Um, again, I've had more subscribers. I love this. I just every every couple of days, once a week, twice a week, I get more subscribers, and I'm loving it. But I'm not in, nearly at three thousand, uh, three hundred, sorry, and I need at least a thousand. So I've got a long way to go. I need every subscriber I can get. But thank you so much for those who have subscribed recently. Anyway, enough chattering. I'll, I'll go now and see you on the next video. Thank you so much. Bye.